But I think in the past, Joe, if I'm not mistaken, you condemned super PACs. Is that correct? You get rid of the nine super PACs you have? I don't have <laughs> nine super I don't have you any have super nine. PACs. You want me to list them? No. Yeah, you go ahead and list okay. them. Okay. Come on. Give me a break. Come no, on. I will, won't give you a break on this one, Joe. You're saying I'm opposed to Social Security, that PolitiFact says is a stat, flat lie, okay. and that the Washington Post said is a flat lie. Oh, well, let me ask you a question, Joe. Yeah. You're right here with me. Yeah. Have you been on the floor of the Senate? You were in the Senate for a few years. Yeah. Time and time again, talking about the necessity, with pride, about cutting Social Security, cutting Medicare, cutting veterans' programs. No. You never said that? No. All right. America, go to the website right now. Go to the YouTube right now. I, when I argued that we should freeze federal spending, I meant Social Security as well. I meant Medicare and Medicaid. I meant veterans' benefits. I meant every single solitary thing in the government. And I not only tried it once, I tried it twice, I tried it a third time, and I tried it a fourth time. Your foreign policy decision-making as president. I learned I can't take the word of a president when, in fact, they assured me that they would not use force. Remember the context. The context was the United Nations Security Council was going to vote to insist that we allow inspectors in to determine whether or not whether or not uh, uh, they, they were, in fact, producing nuclear weapons. I know what happens. I watched the whole Delmarva Peninsula, just like it is in South Carolina and the rest, something I know a little bit about. I wrote the first climate change bill that was in the Congress, which PolitiFact said was a game changer. I'm the guy who came along and said with Dick Luger that we're going to trade. We'll forgive your debt if you don't cut down your farm. not my view. It's not my view. And by the way, everybody who's been in the Congress voted. And in fact, I've gotten 100% rating from NARAL as well.